Okay, so right now we are going to be talking about this. Now, this is a belt, and it is quite long, but it has to be for quite a good reason. Now, that is because on a belt, the belt goes around your waist and connects back together with a cool mechanism that I will tell you about right now. So, first of all, the belt, it is mostly a classy item uh, because the pants that men and women wear, what ends up happening is the pants are too um, loose. So, the belt holds it up for you. And that's pretty much about it. Sometimes belts can be casual, sometimes they can be long, sometimes they can be short. There are many different sizes, and they correspond with pants sizes. So first of all, what you do is, you take one end of the belt, the flap end, and the hook and base end, and then you put the flap end through the hook and base hook end, and then, once you've done that, you take the hook here, and you put it through one of the holes. On this particular belt, there are five. On some, there may be more or less. So, uh, in this case, I will just be putting it through the second hole, just to show you. And then there's another little flap here that you can put this through so that it does not move. And then you just pull, tighten, and then, yep, you have a belt. And that would go around your waist. And then when you are done, you simply pull it out of the flap there and let it fall through or pull it through or whatever is necessary and it becomes a long strap again. So, I can show you right now. On these particular jeans, I don't know if you can see, let's see here, right, right there. There is a hook right there that is on jeans and most classy pants. And what you do is, you take that, the flap end, and you put it through the hooks, and the hooks go all the way, all the way around the body. And once you've done that, you just pull it through, around through the hooks. Now, since these pants are tight, I don't even really need to do this, but we'll just see anyways. So we come through here, through that hook, and sometimes you can feel your way for the hooks. Let's see. Right there. And then coming back around the other way through there. Now if you'd notice, this belt is quite too long. But I believe I can still use it this way. So what you do is, you take this part, you put it through the belt buckle, as I showed you, and then you just select a hole, put it on the hole, put it through the flap, and our pants are tight for you. And then if you wish, you can put your shirt over it and make it a little more average. So there you have it. The belt and the belt buckle. Don't forget to join speech and debate.